Tell me something about yourself. Sample answer. I'm James, a certified journeyman electrician with experience in commercial and residential. And I put first in my job the quality, safety, and customer satisfaction. I have more than five years of experience as electricians. I am knowledgeable in performing electrical installation, maintenance and repairs in homes and plant facilities, and also proficient in national electrical code solving problems with various electrical control and system. Question, can you explain your daily routine at job site, what you do? Can you tell me the usual job you do at work? Give me some examples of things job you do at work. These questions are the same context and you can answer in the same way. Sample answer, installation and layout of electrical boxes and enclosure raceway, conduit, conductors, lighting and switches, service entrance, feeders, and electric motors. What are you measuring when testing a fuse? Sample answer. If you can remove a fuse from the circuit, you are measuring resistance, and it is the easiest way to determine if the fuse is blown by continuity testing. Another way to test a fuse is by measuring the voltage across it with a digital multimeter. This is helpful if the fuse is not able to be easily removed from the circuit. Can you take orders from people younger than you? Sample answer. The thought of whether I am reporting to a younger or older person never enters my mind. My superiors are my superiors. Age never enters into that. Likewise, no other quality or personal attribute will affect my ability to follow instructions. What are the types of electrical systems have you worked on the fast? I have worked on residential services that use a center tap neutral, various 120 volts lighting and various plug loads, 240 volt single phase loads for water heater and electric rains and air conditioner. And for commercial electrical system, three phase 277 and 480 volts and its back loads. 120 volt single phase lighting and convenience outlet or plug. Sample answer number two. I have worked on industrial three phase electrical services like three phase motor loads and also utility power. Note industrial and manufacturing plants have three phase motor loads and 120 volt single phase lighting and convenience outlet or plug. How many bins can you have between junction boxes? Answer. The NEC or National Electrical Code states that there will be no more than four quarter bends between junction boxes. Keep in mind when conduit bending are an offset of two is classed as a 90 degrees bend. Offset between two junction boxes uses up to four 90 degrees bend allowed. EMT or electrical metallic tubing needs to be supported at interval not exceeding EMT must be secured at least every 10 feet and within 3 feet of every outlet or junction box, device box, or other termination. These are the sample of electrical field terms that mostly asked during interview. NEC or National Electrical Code terms, armored cable, field terms BX, non-metallic sheet cable, field terms Romex, Flexible metallic conduit, green field, electrical metallic tubing, thin wall, electrical non metallic tubing, smurf tube, 4 inch square box, 1900 box, device box, 333 box, explosion frop sell off, EYS, ground conductor, neutral. Equipment ground conductor, ground wire, grounding electrode conductor, ground wire, and grounded conductor, hot wire. What lamp is this? Metal halide high intensity discharge lamp, E39 Mughal base, its ID light bulb. Are you able to calculate wire fill? 
you should familiarize yourself on AGLIS electrical reference and national electrical code. There are questions about NEMA and IEC. NEMA stands for National Electrical Manufacturers Administration and IEC stands for International Electrotechnical Commission. Regarding electrical schematic diagram, I have here schematic diagram for NEMA and IEC. Just check the symbol and markings or numbering system. There are also questions about electrician math and basic electrical knowledge. Just check my other video on electrician math and other field interview questions and answer, robotics, hydraulic pneumatics, and many more. Why do we hire you? Sample answer. Because I am a hardworking person and I believe that I am the most qualified applicant for the job. I am knowledgeable in performing electrical wiring installation and repair, troubleshooting, and I am proficient in national electrical code. Why are you interested in this job? Sample answer. I am interested in this job because I am looking for an opportunity that let me exercise my skill. I feel this position will allow me to succeed because my experience is related to the job. Can you tell me something about your previous or something about your experience? I developed extensive skills with the electrical system for the last five years, and I am excellent with commercial and residential installations and repairs, and also knowledgeable in analyzing and solving various electrical problems. Why are you leaving your current or previous job? Sample answer number one. My current job has been a great experience, but the growth is limited because the company is relatively small. I need to look somewhere like this company where there is opportunity to grow my career. Sample answer number two. I'm ready for the next challenge in my career. I love the people I work with and the projects that I work on, but at some point I'm looking for a company where opportunity to grow my career. Do you have a coworker that always annoyed you? How do you handle it? Sample answer. Personally, if I have a coworker that continually annoyed me, I will find some common ground or interest for us to work with and you should stay out of arguments that would cause a negative impact on your job. And if you cannot handle the situations, address the issue to your supervisor or manager. What does PPE stands for? And can you give me an example? Answer. PPE stands for Personal Protective Equipment. It's protective clothing, helmets, goggles, and other equipments designed to protect human body from injury or infection. Describe or explain a time when someone got hurt, what did you do? Sample answer. We are working on a ceiling to install some lights in one of our company projects. And accidentally, one of our co-workers got electrical shock and fell down the floor and broke his right leg. I quickly got the first aid kit and called 911 and our managers for assistance. Do you have any question for us? Sample answer. Always say yes if these questions will be asked. Sample answers. What are the most immediate projects that need to be addressed? What is the next process after the interview? Now, let's proceed to technical questions. Can you draw a schematic diagram of a three-way switch? Here's a sample of three wheel switches for your reference. Technical questions. These jobs require you to bend, crawl, lift heavy loads, entering confined space, noisy environment. Do you have any problem with that? Usually the answer is no. If yes, you need to explain based on your medical and personal condition. Thank you for watching and see you on the next video. If you like this video, Please like, share, and subscribe. Have a good one.